hello to the beautiful people and here we are with a new video and in this video we're gonna talk about how to declare the variables in the dot language so let's move to the code without wasting our time i already uh, declared two data types uh, sorry two uh, variables with the var and the dynamic uh, data types okay so what's the feature of the var what's the difference between the var and the dynamic in a var uh, data type uh, you uh, in a var data type uh, its data type is identified its data type can be inferred by the dot language itself by looking at the value uh, on the right side of the equal sign all right so and in dynamics uh, in dynamics it uh, can also do the same thing it's uh, it's still a dynamic okay so dynamic uh, variable do not have a single uh, do not have a single data type so that's why its data uh, its data type can be changed at any time. So you, okay. So uh, with the variable with the var uh, data type, uh, you can you can't change its data type in a code. Okay, but in dynamic you can do it at any time in a code. So we're just running this code first. Okay. In a war, I already told you the uh, dot uh, infers uh, is a data type by looking at the value. So it's just did it. Uh, it's considered the x and but uh, if I change the value here, if I change it like uh, I want to write it, uh, I want to uh, write that this tick here. Okay. So this is now integer. So this uh, the dot infers the data type of the war uh, variable itself. Okay. So you don't but what i wanted to teach you here is uh, x value if i want to write here flutter okay flutter now you can't do that first of all because uh, we have an error here that value of a type string cannot be assigned to the variable of that type and so in a uh, variable with a var keyword uh, you don't you know uh, you don't uh, give uh, give a data type to that variable but the dot infers this data type uh, by itself and whenever you are using that key keyword uh, sorry whenever you're using that variable in the code uh, and if you want to change this data type so you but you can't change this data type but uh, because its uh, data type was uh, you know identified by the dot itself okay so you can't do this with the uh, variable uh, with the keyword for but you can do it with uh, dynamic and why there, there won't be any uh, there won't be any you know problem in this okay I want to write it 15.0 it's not showing any error because it's a dynamic is where uh, data type can be changed at any time at any place in the code so this that's the beauty of the dynamic and that was the variable uh, that was a uh, variable with a war keyword uh, th uh, that was a major difference between them and we have the other data types too uh, like you know the uh, uh, integer and the double and we don't have a flawed and uh, long in the dot we have a string and all the basic data types and we have a list and uh, we will talk about that uh, other data types in the later videos but for this video the for this video it is enough i guess uh, all you wanted to uh, you know uh, teach the difference between the variable uh, variable with the war keyword and the variable with the dynamic keyword and this is for all this video and if you really like the video if you really find it helpful uh subscribe the channel and hit the bell icon. Bye-bye.